Well, if 2020 has taught us anything, it's that we need to occasionally uh, need to find a getaway from reality. A uh, Mankato artist has certainly found his happy place in this week's Finding Minnesota. WCCO's John Lordson shows us how a streak of silver is worth its weight in gold. You just zero out, you forget everything, everything goes away. In an old building and down an equally old set of stairs, you'll find colorful canvases that offer an escape to somewhere else. This would make Bob Ross blush. Let's put a happy tree that lives right here. Touch I hope so. I it hope it does. Push. He's my hero. Eduardo Axe's love for painting began in high school. It's a hobby and passion that he's passed on to his kids. We just all like to make, you know, we're just, uh, we're painters by trade, so we have a natural aptitude to make and do stuff. That aptitude now extends well beyond oil paints and brushes. Start flipping YouTube channels, and I bump into this silver pouring thing like duck to water. I just got sucked in. Eduardo began buying silver shot, heating it to nearly 2,000 degrees, and then pouring and molding it into bullion. He does what's called graphite molds and sand casting, and when he gets going, silence is not golden. You know, you have to be a little bit mechanical sometimes. It only takes a few minutes to make a piece. The finished product is stamped. And bought. And while Eduardo keeps some of his favorites, this type of artwork is rare. So collectors are constantly calling. You're not really throwing away your money. You will always have the value of silver. For Eduardo, the hobby has become a silver lining during a year that could use a few more silver linings. It's unique. It's like awesome. It's not there. It is. It's, it's not mass produced. In Mankato, John Lordson, WCCO 4 News. And you can see Eduardo's works of art on his Facebook page called Viking Bullion. We'll have a link on our website, WCCO.com.